Welcome back, everyone. Over some more Project Zomboid. She did that weird uh, equipping thing again, which appears to be equipping the lighter for some unknown reason. But, you know, whatever. You do you, lady. Um, but we are going to... I Today, my plan in my continuing quest, or I don't know quest, but interest in entertaining myself and you to go places that um, we don't go very often in playing Zomboid, or at least I don't go very often playing Zomboid. Oh, sorry, Doggo. Just kicked her by accident. Um, we are going to go to the rest stop area between uh, between this place and, Mul and West Point. That's the plan. First, we're going to repair our axe. And we're going to do it again. We're going to put the wood glue away. And our water bottles are almost empty. We're going to have to find some water. Is there some water in here? We still have water in the toilet. Like my version of um, there's always money in the banana stand. There's always water in the toilet. If we get lucky and it rains overnight, I may spend some time uh, planting crops before we leave. But we'll see. 1630. It's a little early. What do we want to do? Do we have anything we need to do? Do we are still carrying anything silly? No. Water bottle, beta blockers, towel. That's good. All right. Um, I'll just let her sleep. This lady can sleep forever. I'm not concerned. Two eight-hour sections will get us to eight o'clock in the morning. Or a seven. That'll work too. Sleep. There you go. There we go. All right. Let's eat some food. I need to take a little bit more food with us, probably. Another bag of chips. No, oh, I'll eat on the road. We should probably take a baseball bat. Just in case something happens while we're out, out and about. Or oot in a boot, as some people might say. Alright. So to get there, we mostly go... Let's put this away, though. Because she'll run faster without it. Um, we mostly go like we did to go to the meth lab cabin that we went to before, but then we keep going. Not exactly the same way, but it's the same general direction. <laughs> I did not leave the map open, so I'm hoping that I remember how to get there. It's, it's, I think it'll be alright, but there's also a decent chance we'll have to sleep there tonight. Um, you know. So if we turn this way, we should hit the train tracks. There they are. We're going to end up following the train tracks most of the way. Which will mean passing by. I'm going to let her walk for a second. I don't want her to wear out too early. Because she is going to have to go quite a ways. We check that. I'm sure we checked that crate. But since we're here, we'll look at it again. Oh, that wasn't the crate. That was. Nothing. Alright. Abandoned train station. With a zombie at it. Say, hey, buddy. Now, basically, if memory serves me correctly, and I probably should have left the map open on my other screen while we were doing this, so as to not take the risk, we basically just follow this. It'll take a bend to the right, which is right there. And then we will follow it until it crosses a road again. And then we will follow the road north. That way. Which I decided a long time ago was north. North, south, east, or east and west. That's my, that's my cardinal directions in this game. Nope, she's getting tired. Alright. Well, we're just going to run her all the way to where she needs to be. When should we get to the end of the train tracks, I'll slow her down. We'll just take our take our chances. So we're leveling up some sprinting here. All right, I feel like it should be coming up soon. If it doesn't, I'm going to be slightly concerned about our complete wrong direction. Right, we're going to let her walk for a bit now.
All right, let's start running again. Come on, turn off. I know you're here somewhere. Starting to get a little worried. Here we went the wrong way. There's a little different ground around the train tracks. Well, if we get to the end of them, because eventually we would get to the end of them, and we haven't found what I'm looking for, we'll just turn around and head home. No harm, no foul. Because there is an edge to the map. Not that I've ever actually... There it is. See, not that I've ever actually been to it, but I know there is, in fact, an edge to the map. So then we need to go north. Let her walk for a little bit. There's a above average chance that on the other side of this thing we're going to have to fight. So we probably don't want her to be too... Um, too... Tired. I don't know what I don't know what the zombie populations will be like there, but I'm feeling they'll be high-ish, medium or better. Oh, hello. Already starting to see zombies. Not clumped though. It's kind of weird. So this is the back side of the rest area. We can kill this one before the other one gets to us. Oh, they're coming out of the woods now. Alright. Stomp her down. There go. Let's take the rounds. Sure. Oh, didn't finish. I should have actually brought a gun with me. That would have probably been a good idea. Come through that tree behind me. Come on. Die, please. Yep. This is like a, a lot of mobile homes around here, if I remember correctly, on the map. And then there's some like supermarket y type places up that direction. We're gonna try and secure a mobile home because we'll probably, as I said, we'll. Almost certainly need to sleep down here today. I would prefer to not have it be too dangerous of an endeavor. Oh, gunshot. That makes things a little bit easier, maybe. We'll see. That makes them easier or harder, depending. These three. You just stay down there, sir. There's no reason for you to get up. Don't want to tax yourself when you're just going to die in a second, anyways. This may not have been one of my best plans ever. I'm just gonna go ahead and admit that. <laughs> I don't know where all, I don't actually know where all the houses are. Like I'm not sure of my orientation with regards to the rest of the mobile home park, which is slightly problematic. 
Or at least it can be, depending on how this turns out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, just, let's, uh, let's run a little bit, shall we? Alright, we got something here. Storage units. Most of those zombies are heading off in a direction that I didn't go. Oh, this looks promising over here. This might be where we spend the night. Yeah, they went that way for some reason. I guess I'm super sneaky and didn't even realize it. get into one of these little houses or one of these little shops without disturbing anybody that would be muy bueno it's a laundromat not exactly a safe place to sleep or maybe maybe in the bathroom three zombies huh Alright, so we got these three down. If the other side... Full bag of rounds. Nothing in the duffel bag? Nope. Alright. If the other side of these, this mobile home is not completely swamped, it could be a safe spot. I'm worrying about stepping on the dog again. But we will not know right away. Until we can very quietly... Very quietly run around. Side. All right, seems to be mostly okay. We'll deal with these guys, and I think we've found a place to stay for the evening. Four of you, five of you. Pretty sure that's two down. All right, is that all of you? Did you all die? That seemed too easy. Alright. Let's poke our head around the side of this building here and check out the surroundings. Seems to be pretty empty. Zombies down there. So we should try the front door first before we use deal with the windows. Hey, there we go. No alarms, please. Thank you. Chocolate. Don't mind if I do. Beef jerky. And some gross old cherries. Cereal. Take the frying pan in case we need a weapon. Situ <laughs> weapon situation turns dire. Seeds. I'll take actually all this. That's a pretty good haul. I don't really like how many windows this building has. Oh, hello. Take you one at a time. There we go. Anything on either of you? Oh, the key. Excellent. Just what I needed. Alright, so we got a sheet. Take the bandage. Sheet makes me a little bit more comfortable because we can add sheet. Close curtains. Which makes gives us a little bit of uh I'll take that book. Are there two of those? Yes, I don't need both of those. I just need one. Is it another sheet? Oh. Hoping for another sheet. I'm gonna rip some sheets though here out of this because we haven't. Uh, I feel like we're running low on those kinds of things, anyways. All right, so let's close. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna hit one more house. I want to see if we can get some sheets. One more sheet for that room that we're in. Make me feel better when we sleep in there. Watch this one have an alarm on it. 
Nope, can't get in that. All right. Can we still open these? No, can't open those. Used to be able to open those. Whereas really, you used to be able to open any window. With varying levels of believability in terms of actually being able to do it in real life. Please open this. I don't want to have to break one of these windows. Ah, crap. Nope. Oh, is there one more? Yes, one more window. She's not going to get it. Oh, she got it. I am, however, stuck in the furniture. Oh, well. No, well, it was almost helpful. <laughs> I don't want to break a window because it's going to attract attention. Probably be okay, though. Ah, screw it. I'm doing it. It's not. Those are good things to find. Not exactly what I was looking for, but. Sometimes there are sheets in here. Garbage bag. Finding a lot of food. I don't usually find this much food in uh, these places. Take this. This is good for. Even rotten, that's useful for an insect insecticide. Mop! I assume you can use that with the uh, cleaning up of blood. Alright. Didn't find what I was looking for, that's okay. We're gonna take our chances anyways and go to bed. Sleep in this chair. This chair seems like a safer place to sleep. Oh, that's not good. Alright, nobody's here. Let's eat the rest of these chips. Sleep for three more hours. Uh, okay, we made it till morning. Just take those with us. Is there ever a zombie outside? Yep, yeah, I figured that. Uh, Gunshot in the night was going to be a problem for us in terms of moving the zombies around. And it appears I was correct. All right. This house seems like it's probably swarmed, but we'll check it out anyways. Nope, I know there are at least two zombies. The one banging in there, this guy. Somebody just broke in that back window. Hello. If you want to come out one at a time, that would make my job much easier. Some zombies moving around behind us. That looks like the one that came in that other window. We're just going to circle a little bit here. Right, there's... Two in there? Two of them. Three of them, maybe? We'll come back. Oh, that was almost bad. Oh, smooth move, Archer. Alright. That wasn't crumulent at all. Dead zombie! Alright, nope, no, 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 log hit. Lots of credit cards. Shouldn't use so many credit cards. If you can't afford to buy it, don't buy it. Don't need credit cards. Good to have one for an emergency situation. Or if you pay it off every month, you can have one for rewards points. But, uh,. Can't afford it, don't buy it. Hello. Hey Beardo, come here. 
No? He's busy. See if we can get these two out. Oh, they wandered away. Hello, sir. There we go. Got him. Nails. Nailed it. More nails. Dog food, last ditch food. Mm, just heard some glass breaking, that's not good. Is that everything there? Yes. Alright. Alright, uh, I'm gonna stop here for today. I hope you're enjoying it. If you are, consider leaving me a like, helps me out a great deal, and I will see you guys back here later for some more Project Zomboid. Thanks so much for joining me.